Hello and welcome to episode 7 of Mac Minute. This week we have a viewer request. We've actually had a couple of these in the last couple of weeks and we decided we better cover it. There is something that seems to be missing in a Mountain Lion, but it really isn't. It's just kind of hidden. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring up the text editor, because we can do it from here. And the thing that everybody seems to think is missing is the save as. So I'm going to save this blank document real quick, just as untitled in my document, just so I have something to do a save as to. So you say I want to re-save this document as a different, different name. So one of the things you notice is there's a save, but there's no save as. And it's like this in all the Apple programs. And it's like, what happened to save as? How do I do a save as? And that's been a very common question and a very frustrating question for a lot of people apparently. Uh, but there is an answer to it. If you hold the option key down, which I'm holding down, it's between the command and the control, you'll see save as shows up. In fact, duplicate changes to save as, as well as close all changes, close changes, changes to close all, which why they did this, I do not know. And I do understand frustration. At some reason, I never really took, I think I learned that through reading the notes and the beta releases of it and just kept on going. So. But that's something that's very important for somebody who's trying to create a new document without having to copy it, going out, closing it, copying it, and recreating it, opening it up again. You can hold down the option key and do save as. So that was this week's Mac Minute tip. I think we may have done it under a minute this week. So we'll see you again next week. Be sure to uh, sign up and to our YouTube or our podcast or whatever. Visit us on the show page. Leave us comments. We love the comments. Like this one was a great one. Uh, something we just skipped over, not even thinking about. And that's the kind of feedback that we need so we know what you are wanting to learn or what kind of problems you're having. And if you're having a problem, you can expect other people are having as well. And we love solving those kind of things and teaching other people you know, how to get around those issues. So do send us a, a voicemail or an email from our show page at techzen.tv slash macminute. Or uh, like I said, leave us a voicemail on Google Voice. The number is on that page. And you can also watch all of our previous episodes right there on the page. And pass it around. Tell your friends. You know, we love to grow this community and visit us, visit us, in fact, at the community on Google Plus as well. You can get to that from the, our page as well. We'll see you next week with another Mac Minute.